Hi everybody! In this video I would like to tell you about the water retaining armature used in domestic water supply and heating. Let's try to figure out which faucet is the most suitable for which girls, as well as consider the pros and cons. Under the concept of shut-off valves falls large list of devices, intended for overlapping milieu and, in our case, water. Faucets located in the bathrooms and valves of the flush tank of the toilet are also a lock armature, but they are not the topic of today's discussion. But taps, valves and valves used in domestic water supply are. Let's consider these types of devices in ascending order by popularity of usage in everyday life. When designing a home water supply system, many of us wonder which faucet is better. It is impossible to answer this question unambiguously. It is possible to say what is the best option needed in a particular wiring diagram, since the same device may be the most appropriate in particular location of the water supply unit. And in the other one, there is absolutely no comply with its parameters and specifics. Taps can have different types of locking. Long time before the appearance of the well-known ball valve in domestic water supply valves and check valves were used valve. The gate valve is a device in which when the flywheel is turned a pass-through hole for the liquid is blocked by perpendicularly located shutter. This type of stop valve is still widely used in public utilities and on various enterprises, where it is necessary to overlap and adjust flows in pipes with large bore diameters, and here in everyday life it is used much less often. Average service life of this locking device, depending on the design features, can vary from 10 to 20 years, and the average operating time of the product to failure from 2 to 3,000 cycles. Often there are disputes about the valves, some claim that the gate valves are equally good as for shutting off and as for adjustment purposes. Others say that the device with a valve must be either completely open or completely closed, all the time, because if the shutter stays closed for a long time, valves in the middle state may close locking elements of the valve to rapid wear. Perhaps such assumptions are not without meaning. After all, when using a valve in pipelines with increased content of abrasive substances, sand or rust, increases the likelihood of accelerated wear of the mating parts, and in consequence, sinks and scratches might appear which can lead to reduction of mating and tightness of the locking unit. In this case, the exception is the valve with a rubberized shutter, but they are only available for pipes with a large diameter, and valves for household needs with a pass-through diameter from 0.5 to 1. They usually have a gate made of brass. However, in most technical descriptions to the valves available on our market, they still say about this product as a shut-off and regulating system armature. In any case, the valves have both its advantages and disadvantages. Disadvantages, however, are very noticeable when using valves in everyday life. The main advantage of the gate valve is considered small hydraulic resistance due to the fact that most products are full pass that is the diameter at the point of the locking device itself is not narrow, and the passage in the tap is straight and does not create additional swirls. Another advantage of such a valve is the small construction length of the device and its maintainability. Minuses The weak point of the valve is the loss of tightness of the locking mechanism due to wear or more often contamination of the seat or gate which is the most cases due to it being treated by cleaning the saddle surfaces. Another weak point is a possible leak from under a rod which can be removed either by tightening hermetic seal nut or by replacement of the gasket, if of course you find it on sale. Also, the disadvantage of such a valve is that it has a large construction height which may affect its installation in tight places with limited space. Another disadvantage of this device is that many do not like the fact that it takes a long time for the gate valve to fully close or open, because you have to make several full turns of the flywheel. Loss of interest in the locking device when using it for household purpose is due to a limited range of these products 
which are presented in retail only by a few manufacturers. The valve is probably a kind of mammoth in modern times among locking devices, and the existing disadvantages neutralize all its advantages when it is used in everyday life. However, in no way related to the use of valves in industry, utilities and other areas where you need to overlap different environments in pipes with large diameters, and where these devices are located, they are simply irreplaceable. Valve or shut-off valve Valve, in its appearance, is very similar to gate valve. The principle of operation of the valve is quite simple. When rotation of the flywheel is transmitted to the spindle located in the device case and having oil seal due to warm gear occurs, forward displacement of the spindle, where at the other end the locking spoon is fixed by gasket. If the valve is closed, the spool reaches the lowest position, rests on the seat. Thanks to that happens the hermetic overlap of the flow of liquid or other environment. Hence the name of the locking device itself, stop valve. Shut-off valves are widely used in water and heating systems. And what is important, they are shut-off and regulating devices, which can have different appearance and design. Average full service life of valves depending on design features and operating conditions is from 20 to 30 years and the time to failure is about 8000 cycles open closed. Valves also have their advantages and disadvantages. Of the advantages, the valve has the ability to smooth flow adjustments and in most cases maintainable and when it's repaired the most common option is replacement spool gaskets or replacement the tightness of the oil seal gasket. The valve has less friction and its parts are located in the production environment and respectively it has a large resource compared to the same one valve. Of the drawbacks, the main drawback of the valve is increased hydraulic resistance, which has to do with the design of the valve. This design increases the probability of formation of stagnant zones in which they can accumulate impurities that contribute to the corrosion process in the housing of the product. With a small exception to the rules, you can probably name direct flow valves that have an inclined location of the spindle, which achieved less hydraulic resistance due to the expanded location of the seat in relation to the flow. Valves can have a certain orientation regarding to the flow movement which must be taken into account when installing them. Also, when operating the valve, there is the probability of separation in case of sticking or shrinking spool gaskets, which leads to loss of sealing and the need for repairs. This situation may occur in cases of long-term position of the valve in closed or open position state, as well as when composing a system with a valve on long time without working environment. This is why many experienced plumbers when installing valves can advise you at least once a year to make a completely closure and opening of the valve. In any case, it's not possible to do in some situation without a valve. For example, in the collector system, thanks to the fence located in the collector comp, a smooth adjustment of flow to individual water collection points or adjustment of the worn water system floor can be made. And for example, a thermal valve located in the heating system helps to regulate the flow of coolant in the heating radiator. Ball valve This type of shut-off valve has recently become a sensation compared to the other types. Although the idea itself is far from new and it's known for more than 100 years. But only with the advent of modern seals such as PTFE, Teflon ball valve was able to become competitive and quickly took its niche among stop valves. Ball valve is a device inside which there is the locking element in the shape of a ball with a passageway. The ball in turn is connected to a handle or lever wire a road. This is how the opening of the ball valve happens. When you turn the handle, inside of the case occurs rotation of the ball and the resulting passageway located in the ball opens the way for the environment. Ball valves can be full pass and reduced, standard pass. Their difference is that a full pass valve has a passageway in the bowl equal to the inner diameter to a connected water pipe, which excludes hydraulic resistance in this section. Reduced have a reduced pass through the hole in the bowl in relation to the inner diameter to a connected water pipe, 
Such taps are used where the increase in hydraulic pressure is not particularly critical. Ball valve is used everywhere in the water supply, heating and even gas supply. In household water supply, the ball valve pushed his older brothers, the gate valve and the valve. As in previous devices, let's look at the pros and cons of ball valve. Probably the first plus of such fitting is its versatility. Since the sphere of its usage is very wide, there is a huge number of modifications of both valve. There are ball valves with internal and external threads. There are ready-made water solutions with spout and fitting. And quick connection ball valves give the possibility of fast connection, corner, three-way and even with a built-in filter. It is impossible not to take into account the reliability and durability of the design. Some models can be functional up to 50 years, and the average time between failures is about 25,000 open-close cycles. Another advantage of the ball valve is that it has small dimensions. They are small construction length and height, which allows it to be widely used in conditions with limited space. And undoubtedly, very important is the fast opening-closing time of the device. Compared to a gate valve or a ball valve, it has the advantage of the ability to block the flow for a quarter of a turn, so from opening to closing you only need to make a 90 degrees turn. For all its undeniable advantages, the ball valve has limitations and disadvantages that are necessary to take into account when designing and installing water pipes. One of the biggest disadvantages of a ball valve is its limitations in its usage, since this device is only a stop valve and doesn't have flow adjustment options. Using such a tap for adjustment is incorrect. Since the ball is not fully rotated, located in the device housing it allows debris and trash to clog under the seal, which may lead to further loss of tightness and failure of the valve itself. It is also important to consider operating a ball valve in the conditions of negative temperature. You should always remember that even in a dehydrated system in the ball valve, between the ball and the body can remain moisture, residues, which due to low temperatures can expand and break the valve body. That, in principle, doesn't strengthen dehydrated valves. Another disadvantage is that most ball valves are a non-collapsible structure and therefore, when damaged, must be completely replaced. It is difficult to say whether this can be called a minus, but the ball valve as well as valve requires periodic opening and closing due to the fact that for a long time rest on the surface of the ball, and in space salts can be deposited between the ball and the body, creating a further obstacle to the normal rotation of the ball, and in some cases even damaging seals. And yet, with all these disadvantages, the ball valve occupies a leading position in terms of use in household needs and in particular in home water supply. Therefore, making a choice in favor of one or the another shut-off device during design and installation home water supply, you must base your decision on the required functionality and features themselves and characteristics of locking devices, since some, for example, ball valve, are the ideal shut-off valve device, while others, valve tab, are capable of making smooth flow adjustments. That is it, subscribe to the channel, leave likes, and see you later.